Alright, Movie Club is back. So, this first movie is going to be Human Centipede 2. And, you know, I'm really in a love-hate relationship with SourceFed after this. Because, on one hand, you know, they provide me with entertainment every day of the week. They brought back the Movie Club. And they were nice enough to wait until after I finished the finals to announce that they were bringing back Movie Club. On the other hand, they made me watch Human Centipede 2. And I don't know about the rest of Movie Club. I've actually seen the first Human Centipede. And the first Human Centipede was shit too. But this just takes it to a whole other fucking level. I mean, this movie is just unbelievably bad. At least with the first movie, it wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. Just because it's built up so much in your mind from what you've heard. That when you actually see it, it's like, okay, that wasn't so bad. This one just tried to... It just tries to throw as much horrific shit at you as possible to see what your breaking point is. And really, there's only so much fucked up shit you can see before you're like, okay, this is, I'm done. And for me, that point was when, was near the very end when the pregnant lady gives birth, then curb sounds her own baby on the accelerator of the car so that she can get away. That to me is just so unbelievably fucked up that I, ju I was just done. Thankfully the movie was pretty much over at that point. Because I have to watch a movie all the way through just so I can get a good feel for whether or not it really is that shitty. And this one is. Uh, I could say a lot more about it, about this movie. Really, the biggest problem I had with this movie was... There is just no chance at all that this isn't realistic. At least with the first one, as crazy and fucked up as it was, you could at least see that there is a small possibility that this, that this could legitimately happen. Like, there is a chance where this crazy dude can just kidnap these foreigners who have no real contact outside, you know, inside the country. But in this one, just a crazy mentally unaware guy just kidnapping people in the area where they have families and nobody's fucking looking for them. Are you fucking really? <sighs> I could go on to a much larger rant and all that, but that's pretty much my basic feelings on the film. So basically, fuck this movie. Don't ever go see it. If you find a physical copy of the movie, burn it so that it will never see the light of day for anybody else. Fuck all the people that pro that protested for it to get it on Netflix so it got onto instant streaming. Fuck whoever picked it out for SourceFed so it forced me to watch it. Well, not forced me, but you get the idea. And, yeah, pretty much fuck everything and anything about this movie. And I'm just going to hope for a lot better movie selection in the future, okay? We already started off with the horrible shit. It can only get better from here, at least I hope.